on a roasting hot day at the Western and Southern Open. It was World Cup 50, Sofia Arbenson who began the day. But as she challenged the top seed, Agnieszka Radvanska, looking for a place in the last 16. It was a strange first set, with both players more effective on the return of serve. And she's broken. Game, and that means five service games, four breaks of serve. There were seven breaks of serve altogether in the first set as Radvanska proved the slightly more consistent. It's gone out. Arvidsson has just given That's away the opening the set, having won right so hard. Oh, it was it was the first match of the week for the world number three, and she now started to feel more comfortable. Class shot. You've got to admit, that is a class shot. Such a it was the kind of effort that makes her one of the title favourites in the absence of Azarenka and Sharapova. There were only seven service holds in the match altogether, but it was still a relatively stress-free victory for the pole. There it is. 6-4, 6-3. It six, took a lot of effort four, from six, the three. Just two days earlier, Patrick Kvitova lifted her first title of the year in Montreal, but there was little time to celebrate before heading southwest to Ohio, where she began her campaign against fellow 22-year-old Mona Bartel. The German began with complete focus as she refused Kvitova the chance to find yeah, any rhythm. Bartel. So, but despite a, a bit of a Bartel's comeback from Kvitova, it's Bartel, love three love up, opening set. Bartel took both of her break yeah, points in the seven. opening set as the Czech Bartel. struggled to impose herself on serve. But Kvitova has won 12 of her last 14 matches and it didn't take long for that kind of form to return, beginning to dictate as she attempted to avoid losing her opening match of a tournament for the third time this season. There he is, pretty comfortably. And uh, Kvitova has arrived, she's taken a yeah, and David's pretty pleased as well. The left-hander had to work hard, but her physical fitness began to shine through the longer the tie wore on. Game to Kvitova, 3-2 up in this final set. And finally, Bartle's resistance had been cracked. It was a relief for the fourth team to win her sixth match in little over a week and clinched just her second victory ever in Cincinnati. In the top half of the draw, Venus Williams was also attempting to book a spot in round three, but her South African opponent Chanel Scapers had different ideas. Wildcard Williams failed to convert any of her four break points in the first set, meaning that when Scapers took both of hers, a shock was on the cards. It's Shapers. First set, 6 2 against Venus Williams. Two breaks of serve did it. Love 40 down in that final game. And she's banking on a pile of Venus Williams errors. The former world number one put a largely wild first set behind her, halving the number of unforced errors as she tried to make it two three set victories in a row. And Williams finally is ahead. Two love in this second set. And despite looking sluggish early on, the American began to dominate and used every ounce of energy to pull through under the punishing sun. Almost does it in style. Up goes the fist. It's Venus panting away who's joined her sister, Serena, in the last 16. In the final match of the day, world number 41, Serena Kirsten, became the beating Montreal finalist, Lee Nard. The Romanian raced out of the blocks, taking the opening three games, but then didn't win another for the rest of the set. It's just a barrage of shots from Lee Nard, who's Struck real good form here, four games in a row. Yours, please. Just to recovered to break three times in the second set, and what's turning into a tense duel. We are into a final set here in the final match of the night. But Lee began to pick up her game and she edged closer to avenging her Wimbledon defeat to the Romanian number two. Game, Lee. She's got it. 
Uh, I have to say, Linar played really well there. It wasn't for Steer playing badly. Lily. Despite saving a match point on a serve, Castell couldn't find a way back. Yes. That's it. Linar's done it. Six Remains six calm to the finish. Six three, six Something Castell could learn from, but Castell's played so well. Going to be very proud of that and accepts defeat gracefully.